What's up guys, Nerdy Noob here, and I have another unboxing video for you today. In this video, I'm gonna be unboxing the 2016 July BAM Box. I don't know if it's called the BAM Box. The BAM Box. Not just BAM, sorry. I think this is the second month of this box that ever since I brought it back to my channel. So I like this box. It has a lot of like cool exclusive things, autographs. It is a little bit pricey. I don't remember how much I paid for it, but I'll look that up in a minute. And yeah, let's go ahead and get this box open. If you are interested in getting this box, I'm gonna put all of the pricing details in the description below for you. Once you get the tape and you open up the box, this is what you're gonna see. I, I feel something falling out. All right, here we go. What do we have here? We got a bunch of cards. Straight out of the band box, wanna trade an item? Well, you can join the party. So, oh, that's cool. I've never seen any of the boxes do this. So they have a little community thing. You can go on their website and, and potentially trade items with other people. That's smart. That is smart. Uh, we have win this Stanley signed Ronan the Accuser photograph. Winner will be announced August 8th. Just post a picture and tag yourself. So there's that. I got a one-up card. I got a yellow one-up card. So I don't know what that's going to be about, but we'll see that in a second. And then we have our BAM pin. Oops. This is July, which the theme was Galactic. And it looks like we got Rocket the Raccoon on our pin. I think that's Rocket the Raccoon. That's what it looks like. And it says True Love on the front. This is the BAM Box exclusive hat pin. I don't know what a hat pin is. Is that a, a pin that you just put on hats? Like what constitutes a hat pin? Okay, let's see what we have. Here we go. The first time we have, oh, look at this. This is a Star Trek pin. It's like what they had on their uniform. Ooh, is this like a ranking pin? Is this, can you take these ones out? Yeah, because like in Star Trek, they had different ones. Like some of them had stripes, but it like depending on how many little things it like determines your ranking, which I don't know exactly like what ranking this would be. But there we go. Oh, I like this a lot. Oh, Bandbox is definitely on point with their pins. Would this be considered a lapel pin? One of my friends just told me that these things are called lapel pins. The next item we have is Mars Space Sand. Never gets wet. Pour the sand into a cup of water, form shapes and figures with the sand underwater. Remove the sand with a spoon and it will be dry. I I'm not gonna try this out because I, I feel like it's gonna be a hot mess, but we got pink Mars Sand, Mars Space Sand. It's like that stuff that you can form underwater and then you just pull it out and it's dry. It's kind of weird, but it's okay. The next item we got is, wait, what is this? Okay, let's see. We got this. It is an alien resurrection thing. It is authentic wardrobe, exclusive costume worn by Ariga Crew. So there's a little piece of a uniform there. This card offered exclusively by the Bandbox features an authentic piece of wardrobe worn by the Ariga Crew in the movie Alien Resurrection, limited edition. Oh, that's cool. And I like this case that they put it in. I don't know, I don't think you're supposed to open it, obviously, but there you go. That's neat. That's a very unique product. Then we got a print. Oh, it's an autographed print. So this print is, it's autographed. It's uh, either 321 or 521 out of 1,999. I don't know who this guy is, but there's the Green Lantern, and he's fighting this other guy. But that's cool, and they package it nicely. There's some nice, it's just a card stock, but they have some cardboard behind it, of course. And then there's your certificate of authenticity. And then the last item we got is, is this a bookend? So this is cool though. It's a Darth Vader, it's metal. And it looks like one of the bookends, although it's kind of slanted, so maybe it's not. But it's like a, it's like a shadow, like a silhouette of Darth Vader. Um, that is very cool. I like that. I don't know, like, again, I don't know if it's like a, ooh, this could be dangerous though, because it's a little bit pointy. Not like sharp pointy, but I could imagine you could still potentially hurt some of this. Like, I almost poked my eye out just now. I feel like it's a bookend, but I don't know, because it is slanted. So I don't know if you could actually put a book on this. Who knows? All right, let's go ahead and look at the card. So the one thing I like about this company is, as you know, I, I got this little card, so I don't know what is one of my one-ups or one of my power-ups, but it seems like I've been watching a lot of unboxing videos for this box specifically, and it seems like a lot of people do get the different like power-ups for this box. There's different colors, which is cool. That means that you have opportunities to get variants of other things, and I like that. So let's do this. The first item we have is our custom handmade steel Star Wars silhouette statues. They're exclusively made this size for the BAM box. They're standing five inch tall with forged steel. 
You could either get Yoda or Boba Fett, but 500 will get a yellow one-up card and will receive the 8-inch Darth Vader. So we got the 8-inch Darth Vader. That's cool. If you didn't get the, the yellow one-up card, then you got either Yoda or Boba Fett. That's very nice. Okay, the second item is our Bambox exclusive True Love Rocket Raccoon and Groot pin. Ah, oh, you could have gotten Groot. That's cool. So you either got Rocket Raccoon or Groot. We got Rocket. You will see when the pins will have to trade to get the set. What am I supposed to trade? And watch out for the green one of a card which shows the black and gold variants numbered on the back of the pin. So you could have potentially gotten the black and gold variants and there are 250 of each of these, I think. I don't know if it's of each or total. But if you got the green one-up card, then you got the variant pin. Neat. We got our Mars Space Sand, so it looks like everyone got that. There's something called a Gold Star Instant Winner. If you get a Gold Star Instant Winner card this month, you will receive a signed comic from titles including Superman, Green Lantern, Infinity War, and others. Check the back of your comic board to see exactly who signed it. So I did not get that, but you potentially could have gotten the Instant Gold Star Winner. You would have gotten one of these comics that is signed. Very nice. We got our... Custom Star Trek The Next Generation Badge and Rank Pin Set. Very nice. I like this. This is probably my favorite item in the box. Um, custom Badge and Ranking Pips Pin Set. They say it's good for cosplay. Cosplay? But I just like this. Probably shouldn't have touched it. I feel like I'm just getting my fingerprints on it. All right. Uh, and the last one is the Bambox, Bambox Exclusive Thanos by Artist Logan Pack or the Battle by Artist Blake Henriksen. So let's see if there's some two artists in the month. You'll see either Thanos by Logan Pack or the Battle. Watch out for the red one-up card to get the Thanos black and white variant or the Battle Red Lantern variant. And then it just talks about the two artists. So there's all the different prints you could have gotten. The Thanos is on the top. And which one was the variant? The black and white was the variant, and then on the bottom is one I got. I got the green one, but the red one was the variant if you got the red one-up card. Oh, and then we got our uh, Bambox exclusive authentic wardrobe card from the movie Alien Resurrection right here. Very cool. All right. I forgot to show you the print. Sorry, there's the print. Um, very nice. So let's go ahead and do some pricing. So month-to-month, uh, -month, this box costs, what is it, $37.98, so $38. Okay, let's go ahead and price some things. Uh, print, it's signed, I'll give it $5. If I, if I got the variant one, it might be worth a little bit more. Moon Sand, I'll go ahead and give that $2. Group Pin, I'll go ahead and give that $3. This Alien Resurrection thing, this is kind of cool. I like the case it came in. I will give that, I would probably say that this isn't worth any more than $8, I think. I don't think I'd pay any more than $8 for it. Really, I think I'd only pay six to seven, but I'll give it eight. Now, this thing is super cool. I really like this a lot, like a lot, a lot. I would probably give this easily $10. I wanna give it a little bit more because there's so much to it. But, and I like the case. Okay, I'm gonna give it $11. That might be kind of high, but I'm gonna give it $11. Uh, what else do we have? Oh, we had one more product. Is that the only thing? Yes. This metal thing. Mm, I don't exactly know what this is for. I like it, and I like that I got the variant. I would probably give this $10 at most, I think. I don't really know what to do with it. How much did I say I paid for this box? So, according to my pricing, I think this box is worth $39. Uh, it costs $38 if you get a month-to-month -month plan, which means that you got $1 extra value on top of what you paid for, which sounds pretty much similar to the last box that I did. I'm glad I got my values worth. This box is cool. I think it could use a couple more items, to be honest, for the price point, because the amount of items that they gave us it's good, but it's about the same number of items that a $20 box like Loot Crate gives us. And I know this company's a little bit smaller, so they probably oh, so they probably can't give us like the exact same type of things. But I think for a box that's gonna cost $38, that they should have at least one to two items. Even if they're like small filler items, I think it'll still help them a little bit. I still like this box a lot. I like the uniqueness of it. It's very unique. I love all the chances to get variants or special edition items. Like most boxes only will every so often 
give you an opportunity to get a variant of one thing where that's like the only variant but this one has so many different variants which is really cool like it's neat to have that chance I like it. it's like winning the lottery and I love that um, I'm a huge fan of things like that so that's why I like this box and I did win one of them I don't know if it's like everyone gets one of these I would have to watch more videos it seemed like when I was watching it a lot of people got these you know because there's so many chances so you almost feel like a winner every time which is nice but yeah you know what this is by far my favorite item in the box and then probably this is my second favorite item in the box. I really enjoy, I like it just because it's Darth Vader. I don't know exactly what it's for, but I like it. If I had to rate this box, this one's a little bit lower for me. The autograph is cool, but it's of an artist that I'm not, you know, like I don't, it's not like I really know that artist. I would probably give this box a probably 3.75 out of 5 noobs. I think that they could do better with, I think that they could include a couple more items and I think they could do better with the value. That's what I would want to see from them to raise that up a little bit. What was the theme? Galactic. I did like how most of the items fit the theme though, so that's good. Sometimes they don't. I think what they should do, like they have a gold star winner where you win a comic book. I think they should have added a comic book and then the gold star winner got the one that was autographed. I think that would have helped out this box. I don't even like comic books, but that would have helped out the value a little bit of this box. I think it would have been helpful. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, feel free to click the like button below. If you want to see more unboxing videos, go and check out my channel. I have a whole bunch on there and you should subscribe. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys thought about this box. A lot of you guys have the band box, so which did did if you have this box did you get any of the one up cards or the star or any of that let me know i'm interested to see if everyone got one or how that worked but yeah let me know what you guys thought about this box and remember if you subscribe to my channel and your subscriptions aren't blocked or set to private you'll make it onto my thank you to subscribers page which is coming up right now thank you guys so much for watching have a great night and i'll see you guys later bye